What's going on, guys? This is Jason with The Trail Ahead of Us. Along with my friend Felix, we set out this morning for Ocala National Forest, which is about an hour and 15 minutes south of Gainesville, Florida, and about an hour and 25 minutes north of Orlando, Florida. Our goal today was to complete the Jeep Badge of Honor for the Tread Lightly Trail, which is currently Florida's only trail offered for the Badge Series. The Tread Lightly Trail is roughly 81 miles long, but you can easily drive many more miles like we did, about 114 on the day, just on the trails themselves. Ocala National Forest is the second largest national protected forest in Florida and covers 607 square miles. The Ocala National Forest, which is established back in 1908, is the oldest national forest east of the Mississippi River and is the southernmost national forest in the United States.
because we found out so many of the secondary fire roads are overgrown and very difficult to navigate. As you can hear, we struggled with constant branches scraping our Jeeps. We probably stopped eight or nine times just to cut back overgrowth on the trails. Along with a few banana spiders we encountered, the Ocala National Forest is home to black bears, alligators, deer, wild boar, bats, coyote, gray and red foxes, river otters, and bobcats, not to mention the large variety of snakes. There's some branches here on the right and left on the ground. See that tree hanging across the road? We should be right next to it. This shit ain't no trail. <laughs> area contains rivers and wetlands and most of these systems are spring fed and in turn can see heavy flooding during the rainy season which in Florida can be upwards of 117 days per year. The Ocala National Forest is one of the most visited areas in Florida and not just by trail junkies but bird watchers, campers, hikers and hunters. Definitely one of my favorite spots on the trip was the chain of lakes. It consists of 600 natural lakes and ponds. Something I learned while doing research on the area was that the movie The Yearling was filmed here in this forestry system. <laughs> 